Hey, this is number 25 in the Gun Show June Expiration this month. It is your last new exercise for the month. We are doing some Delt Death today. And so let's grab your medium or light to medium dumbbells for this. Um, the L rays before we get into that. So let's do the Your Will to Live. And as a last reminder, that was the Y. W T L your will to live uh, drill where we're keeping our shoulders down and back the entire time and holding each pose for about 15 to 20 seconds nicely engaged before you move on so here's the Y here's the T and externally rotate the hand here's the W and here's the L pressing your shoulders back and down while also pressing your elbows into your sides and keeping nice and engaged. All right, so remember that one for the future to continuously do to help mobilize and warm up and correct the posture. All right, <clears throat> I finally got a light to medium set of dumbbells for me, which is eight pounds. Um, I would have gotten 10 as well if they had it, but they didn't, and at least not in the kind that I want. So you want the you want the ones with the hexagon um, to be the most versatile. There is a good use for the ones that are completely circular in the fact that they could roll with you, but these will be more multifunctional as we take things to the floor in the future. So that's just a tip, okay? So even though this is a very light weight at eight pounds, to have a big base on each end makes this more versatile. All right, so the L rays gets its name from the fact that we are making an L position, okay? Back and forth constantly. This is why this is going to be dealt depth. You're basically holding tension on both sides, just relieving each side from the delt area that it's focusing on as we switch, okay? So have an overhand grip to start. So your knuckles facing forward um, or you know straight ahead. And then set your shoulders back and down as normal. And when we start, you basically don't let down until you simply can't do anymore. So L to one side, L to the other, okay? Really, really try to make sure that your wrists are not tweaking on this, okay? And you'll just keep going. And at some point, you might not be able to come to the top, okay? So instead of shrugging it up, or instead of momenting it up, don't do that. Just come up as high as you can until you literally just can't move it anymore, okay? And I could see that my left side, my weaker side, can't even come up to the same level as this one. So do a few extra reps on your weaker side, okay? You can do this also on your knees. The advantage of doing them on your knees is that you do get a extra uh, base of support in which you could squeeze your glutes in order to keep that um, to keep that tension on in the bottom too. Okay, so in a way, it kind of makes it harder. For some people, it might be easier. Okay, so try it both ways and figure out which is the variation for you. And do not defeat the purpose of this by letting the upper traps take over or shrugging it up, okay? So give that a go. Tomorrow we'll do assessment and or a combo and wrap, out the, wrap up the month.